I know you don't care if I happen to stare Cause you know that I think you're sweet If you only knew what I'm about to do Put you in a deep sleep You'll be hypnotized when you look into my eyes And I make you mine to keep it uh, Everything is fine and it's just a fine time To put you in a deep sleep Now you're getting drowsy And your head is hanging low It's time for me to tell you and that was Chance Halliday with his hit song, Deep Sleep. A lovely little Halloween gem from 1961, all about putting a girl in a deep sleep so she falls in love with you. You know, that song is a personal favorite of a famous celebrity we know. Oh yeah? And who's that? Bill Cosby! hey But seriously, guys, remember, assault is never actually funny. Just like you. Oh! What? Well, that was actually hurtful. Speaking of being hurtful, you're going to be in a world of hurt if you're not at the Halloween Bash tonight being hosted by K109.3 The Skeet in the middle of the desert <laughs> at a discreet location. For the love of God, don't tell anybody. So you better be there. <laughs> Isn't it off I-80 by the old lumber mill? Shh. Okay, you're abusing that sound. Wait. This one? Okay, stop. No, no, give me the tea. Stop! We're on the air. Give me the tea. Son of a bitch. I cannot wait to go to that rave. Oh, shit. I'm on E. man hey I'm talking to you get away from my car you fucking junkie Take it easy, man. Hey, Jonah. We got another camera out. Ah, fuck. All right, well... At least we got the technicians coming in a few minutes, and they're going to be working on the cameras anyways. Awesome. All right, so look, I'm going to be gone for a couple of hours. i got to take my kid out trick-or-treating. My wife would do it, but she's out cheating on me. Awesome. So you're going to be in charge until I get back. All right, amigo. Awesome. Are you even listening to me? Awesome. Ugh, I'll be back in a couple of hours. Wait. What? Hey, Brooke. Ah, so you're going as a prostitute for Halloween this year. Hey, I like it. You really know how to sweet-talk a lady.
Well, it's just part of my charm. Oh, yeah, clearly. And what are you supposed to be? Uh, I am Mystique from X-Men disguised as myself. And if you were Mystique, you would actually have a chance with me. Ah, well, in that case, I am Mystique, and you should come with me to that radio station party after work. I'm not going anywhere with you until you quit those nasty-ass cigarettes. That's all I gotta do? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay, then this is gonna be my last one that I'm about to have outside right now. Okay, the bathroom is clean. Now nobody ever use it. Austin, are you about to smoke? I thought yesterday was your last cigarette. No, that was a practice one. Come on, Austin. You have to stop. Okay, this will be my last cigarette. But you have to admit that Star Wars The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. But that is crazy. Say it. Oh, 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 my lungs. Fine. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. Aha! And that is my new ringtone. Thank you very much. Oh, what the fuck? Hey, Austin, you scrawny fuck. Is that hot-ass chick Brooks still working today? Oh, God, he sent you two again. Not our fault, you cheap-ass boss can't afford cameras past 1982. You talk shit about this place like I actually care about this gas station. Hey, uh, just a heads up, Terrell and Claire here. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I wish I was. Hey, Kareem. Hey, uh, how long has this car been sitting here? I don't know. All these cars blend together. Uh, what song was that? I don't know. This wasn't in the playlist. Uh, that's strange. Maybe it was a... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. How about this one? Okay, what is it? How do you know when your sister's on her period? How? When your dad's dick tastes like blood. <laughs> uh, that's fucking gross. <clears throat> do you have any water? Hey, you have to pay for that. What are you talking about? This is on the house. Do you work at Subway? Because you just gave me a foot long. Is that the same foot long you stick in your buddy over there? Fuck you, bitch! So you want to go back to my place or what? Not in my wildest nightmares. <laughs> you know what? Hey, Clay. Can you get a socket wrench from the van? <sighs> Didn't I tell you to grab it on the way in? Grab this dick. Hey, you know this guy standing there? Nah, probably some raver from the party down the road. Well, I'll be damned if some raver is going to be standing in front of my van. Hey! Get the fuck away from my van or I'll fuck you up! Do you think I'm scared of you? You homeless fucking waste of life. Hey, Terrell! Jump in and let's beat this fucker up together. <laughs> oh shit! Clay! Guys! Oh wow, Clay's in trouble. We should do something. God, Clay's fucking dead! Oh my god! Oh shit! Don't we have 
service out here? We should call 911. No. Terrell, didn't we tell you to fix the fucking Wi-Fi? Oh yeah, so I can give them a poke on Facebook or friend them on MySpace? How old are you? Man, fuck you. We can't just sit here. We have to take action. Take it easy, John Wick. Do you even know how to use that thing? Yes. Is the safety on at least? Yes. Yes. Holy fuck, the guy's gone. Guys, guys, we need a plan. She's right. Look, it's pitch black outside. We don't know who this guy is or what he wants. And he has the advantage of the forest around us. Well, maybe Jonah can help. He's not going to be back for a couple of hours. Guys, I don't even think it's a good idea to go outside, alright? We should stay here and wait until morning till it's safe. Are you telling me we're just supposed to sit here and be the bait to this guy? Is that what you really want to do? Go out there? Do you see what that guy did to your fucking friend? His skull is part of the fucking pavement. Huh? Do you really want that to be you? I'd rather leave than stay here. You pussies are just waiting to die. You need to calm down. You're gonna get all of us killed. What the fuck is wrong with you? Whoa, hey, whoa, hey, 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 hey. Back the fuck up. I'm getting out of here. There we go! <laughs> Get the fuck away from me! I told you not to fucking go outside! What did you see? I just feel like someone was watching me. And I feel like I, I, I caught a glimpse of him in- Oh, oh shit! Austin! What the fuck just happened? Trail's fucking dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Brooke. Hey. It's gonna be alright. No. We're all gonna fucking die. Look. We're only gonna make it through this if we calm down and come out with some sort of plan, okay? Alright. Alright. Kareem, go check the cameras. It'll be okay. Guys, I don't see a man here. We need to get out of here. Guys, why don't I just run to my car, I'll floor it to the front, you guys jump in, and we get the hell out of here. Are you sure you want to go alone? It'll be quick. I'll be right back. Brooke, are you okay? That fucker slashed all of our tires. We're not driving out of here. <sighs> Fuck. Damn it. It's been 20 minutes. And he's still standing there. When the fuck is Jonah coming back? To hell with him. We need to come up with a plan right now. We can't do anything. He's standing right outside. How about this? There's only one of him, and there's three of us. On the count of three, everyone runs in a different direction, and whoever finds help comes back to look for the other ones and contacts the police. Isn't that like the worst decision to do in any horror movie? Well, it's either that, or stay here and die. What do you want to do? Fine.
you guys ready? This is a death sentence. Three, two, one, go, go, go. Running. We have to. Ah, oh, shit. No, no. What happened? I left the shotgun at the fucking gas station. It's okay, Austin. We made it far enough from the gas station. We won't need it. Um, let's keep going this way. Look! Help! Hey, 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 stop the car! Stop the car! What in fucking tarnation is going on here? Sheriff, there's this homeless guy. And he went to our gas station and he killed two people. They're fucking dead. And I don't know where our friend Kareem is. Sheriff, please help us. Is this some sort of Halloween prank or some crazy shit? You're acting crazier than a June bug in an owl bean. Please, you have to believe us. People are fucking dead. Okay, fine. Both of you get in the back. We should be going back. It's okay. We have help now. This better not be some prank. Is this the place? Yeah. Okay, you two, stay here. Do not get out. Austin, we're sitting ducks out here. I know. If 
Fuck this. I'm getting out to help him. Stay here. I thought I told you to stay in the car. Why do you have a gun? Forget the gun. I'm here to help you, okay? You don't know what this guy's capable of. Does this look like a fucking prank to you? I gotta call this in. I gotta get back up. Oh my god, bro, are you okay? Dispatch? Is anybody there? We have a 1070 prowler that committed a 1072. Does anybody read me? Hello? Hello, is anybody there? I need backup. I have an injured civilian. Hello? Hello? Is anybody there? Please, any does anybody read me? What the fuck was that?
Where the fuck is he? Where the fuck is he? Where the fuck is he? What in the fuck happened here? Hello? Austin! Look! Is there anybody here? Is, is there anybody there? Hello? I'm so sorry. I'm so, I'm so sorry, Jonah. Stop fucking moving. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back. The Phantom Menace is a better movie than Empire Strikes Back.
You know, all these years, people have been telling me to quit smoking. And I always told them that I'd smoke until the day I died. I lied and said every cigarette was going to be my last one. I guess this one actually is. Only
Last night wasn't just fun and games for everyone, unfortunately. At the Alamo gas station, two gas station attendants were found brutally murdered on site. One with severe head trauma and two that were found on the- Six victims found inside the store, about 300 yards from Alamo gas station. We believe these incidents are not connected, but it uh, could be a coincidence. I'm not sure. I think people just watch too many scary movies. Thanks, Jim. I'm standing in front of the fourth discovered gas station that's been affected by this killing spree. We got information from this gas station from a distress call from a local sheriff. And the explosion of this gas station was heard over two miles away. The only suspect officials could find was dead on site. Officials said the body was so badly burned, they couldn't identify him. While they do look for the people who are the cause of this horrific tragedy, we can only hope that they can catch him in time before they strike again. This is John Tucker reporting for KCBR Channel 47 News.